23 Things They Don't Tell You About Capitalism by Ha Jun Chang is a thought-provoking critique of the dominant neoliberal economic ideology that has shaped global capitalism in recent decades. Drawing from his extensive knowledge as a renowned economist, Chang seeks to demystify common beliefs and assumptions about capitalism that he argues have been propagated by free market proponents since the era of Ronald Reagan. The book is structured around 23 key points, or things, that challenge prevailing economic dogmas. Through a combination of wit and intellectual rigor, Chang provides readers with a comprehensive analysis of how capitalism truly operates, contraries, contrary to the idealized version often presented by mainstream economists and politicians. He encourages readers to rethink the conventional wisdom that often goes unquestioned. Central to Chang's argument is the idea that free market economics, as espoused by neoliberal thinkers, is neither as objective nor as scientifically rigorous as it is often portrayed. He asserts that these economists have not fully disclosed the limitations and potential pitfalls of capitalism, which has led to significant economic challenges, including the financial crisis of 2008. The book serves as a response to why so many people failed to anticipate such economic downturns, suggesting that crucial information about capitalism's vulnerabilities was either overlooked or ignored. Change highlights several misconceptions about capitalism. For instance, he disputes the notion that free markets exist naturally and contends that all markets are inherently regulated, shaped by a variety of political and social factors. Furthermore, he questions the efficiency of free market policies in promoting economic development, arguing that state intervention and regulation are often necessary to achieve sustainable growth and address inequality. The author delves into issues like inequality, examining how unchecked capitalism tends to exacerbate wealth disparities, and addresses the myth of trickle-down economics. He also discusses the limitations of the current education system in preparing individuals to critically assess economic policies, suggesting that a more diverse and inclusive approach to economic education could help foster a better understanding of capitalism's complexities. Chain's critique extends to the corporate world, where he challenges the belief in the inherent efficiency and stability of large corporations. He argues that their pursuit of short-term profits often comes at the expense of long-term stability and social welfare. Additionally, Chang scrutinizes the financial sector, highlighting how excessive deregulation and speculation have contributed to economic instability. The book is not just a critique, but also offers a constructive vision for the future. In the concluding chapter, How to Rebuild the World, Chang proposes ways to reform capitalism to serve more humane ends. He advocates for policies that prioritize human welfare over market efficiency, emphasizing the importance of economic systems that are adaptable to changing social needs and ethical considerations. Throughout the book, Chang draws on historical examples and case studies to support his arguments, demonstrating how different economic policies have yielded varying outcomes across the world. His approach is accessible yet scholarly, making complex economic concepts understandable to a broader audience without sacrificing depth or analytical rigor. In summary, 23 Things They Don't Tell You About Capitalism is a compelling read that encourages readers to critically assess the dominant economic paradigms of our time. By highlighting the often overlooked realities of global capitalism, Chang provides a nuanced perspective that questions the status quo and opens the door to alternative economic models that prioritize human well-being over unfettered market forces. The book serves as both a critique and a call to action for reimagining capitalism in a way that addresses its inherent challenges while striving for a more equitable and sustainable world. You can listen to the full audiobook for free or buy this book by following the URL in the description.